Hi, Craig Farrell with the West Bend Area Chamber of Commerce, and I'm here today with Bill Weinog from Plymouth Dirt Track Racing. And Bill, you are the marketing specialist, I understand. Yes, market, sales, marketing, and promotions. Well, we're glad to have you here. This is a, a brand new member for us, and uh, tell us a little bit about it. I mean, you're, you're in kind of a sexy business, aren't you? It's a fun business. Um, we run most Saturday nights from the end of April through um, end of September. We run 360 sprint cars, late models, Grand Nationals, and B mods, and it's it's a blast. Uh, roughly 100 cars every Saturday night. Wow. You know, uh, we had talked about trying to go out and, and film right there at, at your track, but uh, the weather has not been very uh, uh, cooperating, has it? Right now, uh, we're 0 for 2 on practice sessions, but we'll, we'll give the practice sessions up in order to have racing in a, in a few weeks. Okay. Uh, how did the, uh, the, uh, the track get started? The track was originally a half-mile horse racing track that was built over 100 years ago. Um, when the horse racing went away, we came back with race cars, and, and the track has gone through two or three different changes. About 10 to 15 years ago, we put in a different banking system, redid the entire track, new walls, new fences, and it made for a lot better racing and a lot safer track. Okay, um, and uh, as far as the races now, what days of the week are they, and when do they start? Uh, let's get a little of that information. We open up April 28th, the first, last Saturday in April. We start at 5 o'clock, the racing will start. For the first few nights of through April and May, we are going to start at 5 versus 6 o'clock is our normal time, just to get everybody in and out before the cold really hits um, kids will open up at 3.30, 13 bucks to get in, kids are five, underneath, uh, under the age of 11 is free, so bring your family out, it's a cheap night. Okay, and uh, uh, you're going to race through how late in the year do you, will the races continue? We'll run through the last weekend of September. We have a couple special races coming in this year, um, May 18th, Tony Stewart the, of NASCAR fame will be back with us with his uh, All-Star Circuit of Champions series. Then we'll run the Russ Scheffler night, which is a Friday in June, Friday, June 27th. It's a late model race in tribute to Russ, who was a driver from Milwaukee that came up and raced with us for several years. And then um, we bring in the World Outlaws late models on Monday, July 29th. We mix in a couple other special events, plus 16 weeks of weekly shows. So we have a busy schedule. Wow, it sounds like that. Now, uh, as far as, are there numerous races within the evening, or is it just one long race, or how does that work? We run a set of heat races, which every car that comes in runs a heat race. From that, it determines if you finish in the top three, four, or five, depending on how many cars we have in those classes. You'll run either a B main, which is 15 to 20 laps, and then the feature races are 25 or 30 laps at night. And those are the big money-paying races. Okay. What does the, the big money-paying race pay? Anywhere from, it depends on the class and the night. A lot of nights we have um, different sponsors or spectators. They'll go out and raise money or throw extra money into the pot. So some nights it's over $1,000 to win, depending on your class. Well, maybe I should be doing that as a spare job rather than uh, uh, being here. So we, we have one guy that rents sprint cars. We'll fit you in one. <laughs> Excellent. Now I know where my future is. Uh, anything else you want to tell us? I mean, if people uh, want to get information, certainly they can go to our website, and uh, there is a link right to your site. But uh, if they wanted to go directly to your site, how are they going to do that? Our website is uh, www.plymouthdtr.com, and you can also go to our Facebook page. That's updated a lot more than what the website is. So. Um, we'll have weather updates and event updates and everything there. Um, come out to our track. We have great food. It's reasonable. Um, you can come out and feed a family and enjoy the night for, you know, 50 to to $100. It's a, just a good time. That sounds great. Uh, anything else I should be asking you? Uh, tell me when you're coming because we need to reserve the car for you to put you in and get you to race. <laughs> 
if my wife is watching, don't pay any attention to this. <laughs> uh, no, uh, that sounds like a, like a great opportunity, and I'll, I'll have to, to take a look and uh, see what time I've got once your, your season is up and running. Uh, but uh, uh, at this point, uh, if there's anything else, uh, you know, if people wanted to call, do you have a, uh, a number to, to call? The fair office is 893-5751, and that's 920 area code. Um, it's like I said, it, it's a it's a fun night. It's a fun place to be. We are rated number three uh, in the Travel Wisconsin must see tracks behind Road America. We're the only dirt racing track that was located or on that survey. Um, the other the other parts of it is we have drivers from the West Bend area, Milwaukee area, up north in Green Bay. It's just a wide variety of attracted people from drivers, spectators, and everything else. Well, and uh, Plymouth is not that far away from us, so it's a, an easy drive uh, for a, an evening. And uh, for a family, I would think this is perfect because uh, you know, it doesn't cost a lot, and uh, you can certainly kid, keep the kids entertained uh, while all the races are going on. We do a lot of nights we give things away for the kids. We have a couple nights we give away flags, American flags. Um, one night we do checkered flags, and then the kids can go into the pit area after and have them autographed. Every night when we're done racing, the pits open up to anybody to go in. So it's a great way to get the kids into the pit area. Some drivers will let them hop in their cars and do, you know, check it out and everything else. And we need to get the kids involved because they're the future of our sport. Absolutely. Well, would you like to cut a ribbon? Sure, let's do that. Okay, are you all set to cut? I'm set. On a count of three. One, two, three, cut. You are now official. Thank you very much. So glad to have you as one of our newest members. And I have for your organization a West Bend Area Chamber plaque. Uh, we wish you a lot of luck and bring a lot of people out of the West Bend Area. and. Like I said, don't tell my wife I'm going to come out and race. <laughs> With that, thank you.